Hi, I'm Chandler, and I'm a bridesmaid. My name is Riley, and I'm the maid of honor. Woo! One of eight bridesmaids. Sammy girl, my girl, you're getting married. I am so ready to party with you, home girl. Thanks for picking me for your maid of honor. Woo! Oh! Am I upset that I didn't get chosen for maid of honor? Even though I've known Samantha since we were both seven and I never told anyone that went down at spring formal in 2016. I was so happy, but not surprised that she told me I was her pick for maid of honor. <laughs> I'm just honored to have been chosen. Oh yeah, and I can't wait to make this day perfect for her. We met in the same sorority, Delta Zeta Nu! Woo -woo! <laughs> at first I kind of thought she was a bitch, but now these bitches can suck it. <laughs> Kidding! I saved her dog from a house fire when I was seven years old. Yeah, we didn't even really hang out until senior year when I had to hold her hair back when she was yakking. <laughs> Maybe that's why she picked me for maid of honor. How would I plan the wedding? Well, I think I'd go with an outdoor ceremony with a rustic chic theme. Samantha's favorite flowers are sunflowers, so I'd incorporate that into the decor. Ooh, and for the reception, I'd serve her favorite dishes from the places that she and the groom have traveled to. She would love it. So how are you planning the wedding? Huh? You mean I was supposed to plan the wedding? She likes Book and Beppo, right? Let's go with that. I also planned the entire bachelorette party, but I guess that was just a nice gesture, since I have a natural talent for planning and organizing. Keyword talent that some people do not have. Not everyone can handle the pressure of being maid of honor. It takes a special type of person, and I think Samantha saw that in me, because I was the only person who told the ugly girls that they couldn't be in our house. And that takes guts on my part. So, what's your favorite memory with the bride? Oh, there are just so many to choose from. It'd have to be a tie between when we got baptized together, or that time that I won tickets to our favorite band, the 1975. Oh, wow, that was an amazing night. Oh, the first time we did shrooms together. <laughs> Honestly, I feel like I have more memory loss than memories with her, am I right? <laughs> Good time. If you could tell the bride one thing, what would it be? Samantha, I just want you to know that your friendship means so much to me. You're my sister for life, girl. And I would literally take a bullet for you. Kind of like when I actually did. Remember when we ran into that gang in downtown LA? Remember when I was in a coma for two years of my life that I'll never get back? Do you remember Barth, Bartholomew? Your dog that I saved from the house fire when we were both seven? Remember that? I'm so happy that I can be your bullet-taking, dog-saving, fire-facing bridesmaid. <laughs> if you could tell the bride one thing, what would it be? Okay, your future husband is super hot. <laughs> Just kidding. Can't wait to get f***ed up with you. Woo! <laughs> can you share any advice for the bride and groom? Ben, remember that Samantha is scared of heights and don't forget about that peanut allergy, okay? And Samantha, remember that Ben's love language is gifts. Ah, but you guys are gonna be so happy together. You guys are true soulmates. Did I mention that I was the one that set them up? Any advice for the bride and groom? Yeah, at your next wedding, have an open bar. <laughs> Honestly, I don't need to give any advice to the bride and groom because I'm gonna give her MDMA for her wedding night and I plan to slip some into Ben's champagne too. So what's been the biggest challenge of being a part of this wedding? If I'm being honest, I thought that after all I'd been through together with Samantha, she would have picked me to be her maid of honor. But I'm honestly just so grateful that I get to be a part of Sammy's big day. Love you, girl. What's been the biggest challenge of being a part of this wedding? It is so hard to get the za past TSA, but huzzah, we made it.